Are you serious? Are you serious? Folks, we just got to give you some. These are three photos that I received from Stephen of Oklahoma. Now, they, they shut down five Walmarts. Five Walmarts were shut down last week. One of them was in Tulsa, Oklahoma. And Stephen of Oklahoma went there and saw a very suspicious. I mean, if these Walmarts were shut down for plumbing, uh, somebody help me understand why all this security was there. I mean, pull up right next to the door. Uh, you can see police car, uh, uh, what looks like another armored vehicle. Uh, it's not armored, but it's, it's, it looks like a Brinks truck, but I don't think it's a Brinks truck. And remember, this Walmart's been closed for uh, almost a week. And they gave their employees five hours notice to get out. It's over. Lose your jobs. Goodbye. Um, here's another photo. Now, this was out in the parking lot. And there were several of these in different locations all around this thing. Okay. Um, security everywhere. Right? Here's, another, here's another shot right up next to the door. I mean, right up next to the door, they're at Walmart. So they had all kinds of security everywhere. And, and matter of fact, he had some other shots as well. But I'm just going to use these three. I mean, just everywhere. There is security at a Walmart that if it's closed for plumbing, I understand you have to have a security guard or two. But... I mean, we're talking broad daylight, security everywhere, everywhere at this Walmart. And, of course, Stephen was able to get in there and take a couple pictures and get out of there. And there were other people, actually, in the parking lot. But, you know, the store's closed for plumbing. So what's going on here? Now, I was looking at the police car. That looks like a local Tulsa police. That... Um, is some type of, I don't know if that's, doesn't look like a state police. That looks like a more of a security uh, that was hired. And I think also this big one there, this big truck, I think that's another security group. All right. Uh, but there were several different, uh, and just a lot of security, very suspicious, right up next to the doors and scattered out around the premises high security around one of the five walmarts that were closed and of course a lot of folks are wondering why was the word plumbing why did they say all five of them had to be closed down for plumbing five walmarts five different locations and only gave their employees five hours notice and then we have the you know is the question is is plumbing the code word and then we find out about the tunnels that are underground a lot of these walmarts have these tunnels they're leading toward storage buildings or facilities. Some people have said that it could be leading towards some uh, FEMA camps close by. I don't know. I do know uh, that Janet Napolitano, I did a video about this, where she said five years ago that Walmart was going to work very close with Homeland Security. Uh, so there's just a lot of unknown questions here. We're going to continue to keep an eye on what's going on. Um, we got Jade Helm operation, a military covert op operation, and now Canada is closing 133 Target Target stores. What's that about? A lot of tanks, a lot of movement going on everywhere, both in Canada and in America. Hey guys, I'm, again, I'll leave the link to his website below. That's Paul Blakely High Security that closed Walmart. Tulsa, Oklahoma. There's some strange, strange stuff going on just for plumbing problems, y'all. I'll tell you what, if I had plumbing problems, I hope I get a response like that, that my stuff would get fixed real quick. That's all I got to say. Again, I'll leave all this for y'all uh, to decide on. I'm just trying to get the information out there. And it's getting to be a lot, as you can see. <laughs> Y'all have a good day. Stay safe.
If y'all have any more information, anybody got any information, please send it to me. I'll try to get it out. Y'all have a good day and God bless.